The Edinburgh Mill Handicap Hurdle is next, another Handicap Hurdle, two miles and one furlong this time. And another small field, not to 100 this time though. And at the top we've got Totic Youth for John Morgan. John Morgan and not to 100. Poster Seductress Thomas Rogers Beckham for Derek Hinton. Sir Cozy Mover for Alex Cherry. Billy Rubin for Matt Cooper has also got Big Bad Bob. And Miles Aura for Thomas Rogers. So not to 100 hurdle. Seven runners in it. Called in and away. And post the seductress. The only grey in the field is the first to show. Pulling for its head wants to go quicker than the jockey wants to let it. And we've got some big name trainers in a race that's a nought to a hundred. You wouldn't expect really, would you, to see Darren Thompson and John Morgan in a nought to hundred race, but they are. So those will probably be the two to focus on, I would have thought. It's Beckham who's in the lead from Tossic Youth in second, and Big Bad Bob is in third, Miles Aura fourth, and then Post the Seductress, Sir uh, Cozy Mover, and Billy Rubin at the back. They're all safely over the first of the nine flights that they've got to take. And Beckham is clear in front. By about three lengths. Good job Stu's not commentated on this one. He'd be having a raving fit, wouldn't he, about Darren Thompson and John Morgan being in this race. I mean, it's a go at me about being in the Hunters. I'll be commentating on one or two of mine in them later. So, we'll see what he's got to say today. He was pretty grumpy about my little misfortune again yesterday, saying she was running over the wrong distance. Well, the fact of the matter is, she's a two and a quarter miler, really. So, sometimes she has to run over two, sometimes she has to run over two and a half. And... He's thinking I'm trying to get a better weight for her at Cheltenham next week. Well, she won't be running at Cheltenham next week because I'm pretty sure there's an 18 furlong race for her at Fontwell or somewhere. And she'll be far better off in. So, put that in your pipe and smoke it, Mr Grey. Anyway, Beckham's in the lead. And toss it. He's just figured out, figured out that there's absolutely no point in me saying all that because he won't be watching this because he hasn't got a horse in it. Anyway, it's Beckham in the lead. From toss it, youth in second. And then Miles Aura is third, Big Bad Bob, and Sir Cozy Mover. As they get over the fourth, the grey poster seductress has dropped to the back. It's Beckham in the lead. And just to remind everybody in case you concern this stuff with me and Stu, it's all done in the best possible taste with the best of mates really just like winding each other up yeah, it's Beckham in the lead from Miles Aura second Big Bad Bob is third then Tossic Youth and Sir Cozy Mover as they get over the six just three more flights left to take now then a Miles Aura has gone into the lead Tossic Youth on the inside is second then Big Bad Bob is third Beckham's dropped back into fourth and then a small gap to the back three of Virgil in a line Sir Cozy Mover Billy Rubin and Poster Seductress the Grey but it's Miles Aura who's going to lead them into the straight with John Morgan's Tossic Youth on his inside and Big Bad Bob back in third uh, Sir Cozy Mover's trying to come around the outside in fourth Beckham must be one of the lower lights in the Darren Thompson yard I think because it's struggling in this one as they get over the third last and it's Miles Aura with the lead Sir Cozy Mover trying to give Alex Cherry a quick fire double in the first two races of the day, they've only got two more flights to take, and Sir Cozy Mover has come through to take it up from Miles Aura in second. Over the second last they go, and Sir Cozy Mover is in the lead by a length from Miles Aura in second. Then comes Big Bad Bob, Tossic Youth, and Poster Seductress, and next big gap to the rest of them. You can forget them, but it's Sir Cozy Mover coming to the last. Gets over it in the lead from Miles Aura in second. Poster Seductress is one on in third, but it looks like this is going to be another one for Alex Cherry, the Scottish trainer. Going to take another one the Scottish track is he but Miles Aura is beginning to close and Miles Aura steals it on the line from Sir Cozy Mover in second so Alex Cherry stole the first race on the line and he gets the second race stolen back off him on the line this time with Thomas Rogers' Miles Aura getting up on the inside to take it and the two big guns were nowhere were they so just goes to show if you're not necessarily a top quality yours doesn't matter what stable you come from so Miles Aura for Thomas Rogers is the winner Sir Cozy Moore for Alex Cherry is second 
Big Bad Bob for Matt Cooper is third. Post of Seduction for Thomas Rogers is fourth. And Toss It You for John Morgan was fifth. And you can see there that Beckham is trained by Derek Hinton and was running Darren Thompson's colours. Now, I'm making this statement now, and I mean it. Next week, any race that's got the wrong silks in, I'm not compensating on it because we compensate on 45, 60 races a week. And if the race runners can't be bothered to load the right file up, then I can't be bothered to compensate on them. <laughs>